Woman finds a weird bird. When Vet sees it, he says, this can't be true. When Carol stumbled upon a strange bird in her backyard, she never imagined it would cause such a commotion. The bird was unlike anything she had ever seen, with vibrant feathers and an unusual chirping sound. Despite her initial excitement, Carol quickly realized that she needed help identifying the strange creature. Determined to find out what she had stumbled upon, Carol took the bird to the local vet, Dr. Peters. But when Dr. Peters laid eyes on the bird, he was completely taken aback. This can't be true, he exclaimed. This species was thought to be extinct for decades. How could it possibly be here? Hey there, viral videos here. Before we go on, like this video, smash the subscribe button, and click the notification bell. We post the most beautiful, amazing, and scary videos every single day. Let's proceed with the video. The vet was referring to the highly endangered mythical bird known as the rainbow lorikeet. This species was renowned for its stunning feathers, which appeared to change color in the sunlight, reflecting hues of blue, green, and purple. However, with its dwindling numbers, most experts believed that the rainbow lorikeet was nothing more than a distant memory. But now, here it was, in Carol's backyard, alive and well. This discovery was more than just a mere coincidence. It was a sign of hope for an entire species on the brink of extinction. As Carol and Dr. Peters delved deeper into the mystery of this bird, they were soon transported on a journey of adventure and discovery, unearthing secrets about the rainbow lorikeet that had been lost to the world for far too long. Carol was a quiet, reserved woman in her mid-40s who lived a simple life in a small town on the outskirts of the city. She spent most of her days tending to her garden and reading books in the local library. Carol was known for her green thumb, and her yard was a vibrant and lush oasis, filled with colorful flowers and chirping birds. Despite her peaceful existence, Carol had always felt like something was missing from her life. She longed for adventure and excitement, a chance to break free from her routine and experience something new. One day, as she was working in her garden, Carol heard a strange chirping sound that caught her attention. She followed the sound to a small shrub in the corner of her yard and was shocked to see a bird unlike any she had ever seen before. It had bright, vibrant feathers that shimmered in the sunlight, and a curious, almost intelligent look in its eye. Carol was entranced by the bird, and she felt a sudden spark of excitement in her chest. She had always been fascinated by birds, but she had never seen one like this before. She knew that she needed to find out more about this mysterious creature. So, Carol set out on a quest to identify the bird, determined to uncover its secrets and learn more about its origin. She visited the local library and scoured books and websites, but she couldn't find any information that matched the description of the bird she had seen. It was then that Carol decided to take the bird to the local vet, Dr. Peters, for help. She carefully placed the bird in a cage and made her way to the clinic, her heart pounding with anticipation. As she walked through the door, she couldn't help but feel like her life was about to change forever. As Carol made her way to the local vet's office, she couldn't help but feel a sense of excitement. She was determined to find out what type of bird she had stumbled upon, and she was eager to share her discovery with someone who could help. When she arrived at Dr. Peter's office, she was greeted by a group of birds that were flitting about in their cages. There were colorful parakeets, majestic eagles, and even a few unusual species that Carol had never seen before. She marveled at their beauty, each bird a unique masterpiece of nature's artistry. Dr. Peters welcomed Carol warmly and immediately got to work, examining the bird she had brought with her. He carefully examined its feathers and its beak, taking note of its size and its color. He listened to its chirping and studied its behavior, trying to identify what type of bird it was. As Carol watched, she realized that there were many different types of birds in the area, each with its own unique features and characteristics. Some were small and colorful, like the parakeets, while others were large and powerful, like the eagles. She told Dr. Peters about the different birds she had seen in her backyard. 
From the bright yellow canaries to the graceful doves, she mentioned the different songs they sang and the way they flitted from branch to branch. However, despite all her observations, Carol realized that she had never seen a bird with purple feathers. She found this strange, as purple was such a unique and eye-catching color. She wondered why she had never seen a bird like that before. As Dr. Peters finished his examination, Carol couldn't help but feel a sense of anticipation. She was eager to find out what type of bird she had discovered and what it could mean for her and the world of ornithology. Little did she know that this was just the beginning of a journey that would take her on a wild and unforgettable adventure. Dr. Peters was shocked by what he saw. The bird that Carol had brought in was nothing like he had ever seen before. Its vibrant purple feathers shimmered in the light, and its beak was a delicate shade of pink. The bird seemed perfectly healthy, and yet Dr. Peters couldn't find any information about it in his books or on his computer. Determined to get to the bottom of this mystery, Dr. Peters called in all of his colleagues to take a look at the bird. They crowded around, each one more amazed than the last. They had never seen anything like it before, and they couldn't believe that it was real. One of the vets, a well-known ornithologist, suggested that the bird might be a species that was thought to be extinct. The group was stunned by this suggestion. They quickly gathered all of the resources they could find and began to study the bird in depth, taking measurements and analyzing its DNA. The news of the mysterious purple bird quickly spread, and soon Carol and the bird were the talk of the nation. People flocked to the vet's office, eager to see the incredible creature for themselves. Reporters from all over the world descended upon the small town, hoping to get a glimpse of the bird and to speak with Carol. Carol was overwhelmed by the attention. She had never been in the spotlight before, and she wasn't sure how to handle it. But she was also fascinated by the bird and eager to learn more about its origins. As the investigation into the bird continued, the world watched with bated breath. People were amazed by its beauty and captivated by its mystery. Scientists and ornithologists worked tirelessly, determined to uncover the truth about the bird and to determine if it was truly a species that was thought to be extinct. After weeks of intense study and investigation, the truth about the purple bird was finally revealed. It turned out that the bird was not a species that was thought to be extinct, but rather a failed chick that had been pushed out of its nest by its mother. The chick had been struggling to survive on its own, but its unique coloring and distinctive features had caught Carol's attention. Although the revelation was a bit of a disappointment for the ornithologists and scientists who had been studying the bird, it was a huge relief for Carol. She was happy to know that the bird was not a rare or endangered species and that it could be cared for and protected. Dr. Peters and his team worked tirelessly to care for the chick and to help it grow strong and healthy. They were determined to ensure that the bird would have a happy and healthy life, and they were amazed by how quickly it grew and flourished. As the chick grew, it became more and more confident and playful. It flitted and flapped its wings and sang a sweet, melodious song. Carol was charmed by its antics and she felt a strong connection to the bird. Eventually, the time came for the chick to be released back into the wild. Carol was filled with mixed emotions as she watched the bird take flight for the first time. She was sad to see it go, but she was also happy to know that it was going to be able to live a full and happy life in the wild. And so, the purple bird became a symbol of hope and resilience. People all over the world were inspired by its story, and they were amazed by its beauty and strength. Carol was hailed as a hero, and her discovery was celebrated as a triumph of the human spirit. What did you think of this story? Let me know your thoughts in the comments. Like the video and subscribe. See you next time!